What is happening, YouTube? Here we go, here we go, here we go. You already know what it is. Today is another one of those days that end in Y. So you know that makes it a great day to go fishing. It is Drysdale, and I'm out here on the water with my with my man from hometown Cincinnati, Desmond. How's it going? Desmond hadn't fished in a hundred years. We fished back in the <laughs> back in the early, the late either the early 90s or the late 80s so um i'm gonna see if i can put desmond on some of these lake oconee horses y'all know how i do before we get started let me let y'all know if you haven't already subscribed to this channel go ahead and hit that hit that subscribe button right there along with that bell so that you get notified when i post new videos so let's see how we do on this episode of crappy fishing with drysdale let's go get them time you cast you want to cast parallel to this like if you just say you never you don't want to cross it you, you want to go parallel to the to the angle okay. that it's going and you'll see like if you watch that you'll see my bait fall. So, so i'm going parallel to it my bait's going to start falling right there you see that that little blur yeah. yeah so my bait's falling and you'll see that fish you'll see the fish coming out you see the fish coming to me yeah One hits it, I'll feel a little thump. So chasing, still so chasing. You hit me, I miss it. So this was so when you throw it in, do you when they first tug, you don't you don't pull it right away, right? When you feel that thump, set that hook. When, when he if he touch it, no, but if he snag it. If you feel that, if you feel that thump, set your hook. Right. The wind, which means yeah, just pull it up. Pull. You don't have to start reeling. Yeah. All you do when you set your hook is just putting the hook, hook in, it, hooking in his mouth. Yep. Yeah. When I was sitting there and you said, Yep, there they are. I'm like, I see in the dark water. You can't see that. <laughs> yeah. I didn't know that was a thing. Uh huh. So this gives you eyes in the water. Mm, a little bit of a difference. You see how they done turn around? Yeah. Come on, none of them like me. First one we got that's probably about 10 inches. Let's see what it feel like, what it what it weigh, what it scales at. The Maserati ain't no way I rented it. Well, you yeah, must have mean I got the money where if anything happened, I'm okay. But that's a good fish. Damn. I'm not supposed to catch that. 
tree. You can't catch them. You can't catch them till you get your butt catch a line in the water. Finally got a good one today. A real good one. I guess I say can't say finally. Because the other one I got was 11 inches. But this one's a no doubter. She's fat and she long. Don't call me fat. I'm pleasantly plump. This is a nice fish. You only fry up nicely. I'm gonna fry them. Get them out of the water. Oh, okay. You can get this with some camera love. So let me My show you how you fish in 20 years. There you go, man. Hey, we got about a bottom lip. Take a look out. There we go, folks. Oh, you gotta take the picture. Can you oh, I'll get your picture. Yeah. Uh, <coughs> all right, don't bite me. Are those teeth? They don't have teeth, they got grinders. That's even worse. Look, Mom, my first fish. <laughs> <laughs> All right, got him here. That's a good sized fish, too. See, this is, is we, that little if we can catch 20 or 30 of them, you talking about that on the bottom? Yeah. No, nah, they might. It's just, you can call them what you want to. They, they, they might be baby, baby. Them grinders, they don't have teeth. Nice fat back. She's a good, probably 12 and a half inches. He what? She don't fit in the cup. Oh, shoot. I got him. I got him. He hit this good, too. You little runt. How you hit that hard? How did you hit that hard, you little baby? I'm a chicken hawk. Get on out of here. Down here. Uh, we got on, I don't know, don't make me lie to you, eight something. Yeah. Oh, oh, I just got something. That's a good fish. I got, ooh, I got something. Side of the gill. I caught that one on the side. No wonder it felt like a good fish. He might be 10 inches. I bet you this fish 10 inches. My, my calibration be off. We got three in the live well. Or two in the live well. Yeah, Dad's got one. Yep. Three quarters. He said, What? What'd you say? Yeah, we all speak it. Uh, yeah. Did you get one within 10 minutes? No. <laughs> <laughs> within no. 10 minutes? No, I told him, I said, if I don't catch one in 10 minutes, I'm ready to go. <laughs> nope. Ain't quite 10, about 8. That's 10 and a half inches, man. Where's the, t where's the mark at? Where's the 10? Okay. Hey. YouTube, I'm so sorry. 10 and 10 and a half inches fish just seems small to me. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to do better. I'm trying to do better. The bad thing is, I just saw an 11 inch one that I was like, oh, we're gonna keep it. I've been looking for the thickness and the thickness of the fish. But hey, if you wanna do business with me, 
I, this this will affect negatively impact my business. And hey, I can't have it. Oh, I forgot to tell you, you gotta hold your mouth a certain kind of way. I think you hold your mouth wrong. Okay. Top one gotta go over to but, but turn the bottom one sideways. <laughs> <laughs> I'll decide. <laughs> oh. I'm trying to get him. Oh, man, he got off. Yeah, right. Look at the baby. Come here. There you go. We got another one. She ain't big, but she won. Put the rod down. Got another one. Small. She ain't big, but she won. Look at the baby. Look at the baby. We can throw that one back. But at least you caught one. Oh, here's all the way down there. Oh, that one comes out of the eye. Don't out here now, get! You wanna take a picture with this one too? Yeah. Why not? Grab the picture from the video. I know you see me this on the my video. my third fish in 25 years. I'm on a hot streak. He's on fire! I'm gonna throw you back. Just give me a second. We're gonna do a photo shoot. I don't want my picture taken. No, no, no. Well, we can either take your picture. Smile. That one gonna keep. That one gonna keep. Open up that live well for me behind you, would you please, sir? Uh, Open up that live well. Do what? Put that in the live well. Oh. I guess this little stuff that non fishermen don't think about. You think, like me, my, I just, you just throw it in away from the hip. You know, I'm starting to get the stuff you say. Yeah, so that's what's making it more enjoyable. Small details matter. It's the details. And the one thing I always say I can't do, I can tell you a whole bunch of stuff, but I can't teach you to feel. Oh, 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 oh. Does that mean you? I think, I think we might be crossed. <laughs> nope, no, we're not. I felt something. I thought it would be a good Yeah, it might have been. But yeah, I can't teach what it feels like. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Look at the beans. Are you crossing or are you careless? I'm crossing. All right, well, that's the problem. Ow. Oh, I'm caught again, I bet. Yep, you are. So, here's what happens, folks. Mm -hmm. When you get hung, you know how, like, Steph Curry shoots a three pointer and he come down and starts shimmying? When you get, and his form be so sweet? Mm -hmm. When you get hung like that, and your form be so sweet, you gotta shit me for a camera. Oh. Uh -uh, camera's behind you. <laughs> 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 uh, wrong, Jimmy. <laughs> uh. So come up here and shit me for the people. Shit me for the people. Turn around, shit me for the people. I get down look. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that hook set was beautiful. And he hooked it sitting back on the tree. Got him out. You're like, wait, hold on, I'm gonna hook around. What? <laughs> What's down here? Yeah, you caught the biggest black crappy ever. Oh man. Yeah, that's good. She gonna keep on, she gonna keep. So now what I'll do. So you always grab them in this spot right here? Did you feel it? 
Another one. <laughs> <laughs> hey, now you get that out of there. Oh shit, it's already got it's already loose. Oh, look at my ear. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What's up? Oh, get, get that out of my ear. Hold on, hold on. We got a lot going on right here, YouTube. There we go. All right, YouTube. He done hooked me. I done hooked another smish, smish. I done hooked another fish. That is gonna do it for this episode of Crappy Fishing with Drysdale. Um, Dez, what you got, man? What you got? Tell the folks something. How'd you enjoy the day? Actually, I didn't know what to expect because I haven't been fishing in a long time, but I'm glad I came. And actually, I'm looking forward to doing it again. The last time you went, were you with me? Yeah. Yeah, that was, yeah, the last time I went was with you, and that was. We've been right. friends for about 30 right. some odd years, man. Yeah, three decades, while. three decades, it's and this is what we're ending with, these little dinks. <laughs> right. Go on out of here now, I'm good. Right. See you. So, folks, as always, thank you all uh, for watching. Oh, man, he's oh. he going to be all right. Wake up. <laughs> as always, folks, thank oh, you so much for watching. If you have not already done so, go ahead and hit that subscribe button right there, along with the bell, so that you get notified when I post new videos. For my new subscribers, welcome to the Drysdale family. Old subscribers, thank you all so much for your continued support. And if either of y'all want any specific content, feel free to put that in the comment section below. And I will do my best to bring you the content that you are asking for. Until the next time, folks, remember, the best days to go fishing are the ones that end in Y. Drysdale out. See you. <laughs>